Lads and ladies, it is me, Roy Olivia, and in case you can't tell, I am sunburnt as shit right now! I was away scouting European soccer in the sunny land of Spain, so I didn't post a video last weekend, and I guess I could have forced the issue if I really wanted to post a video, but I sort of had like a sober epiphany of sorts. Because I hadn't won any rewards worthwhile, I've done a few little wins you can see on the screen right now, and nothing of interest had happened in the sober world, so I sort of thought, you know, what's, what's the fucking point? Who am I posting this video for? And that's my feeling around sober content in general right now. For me, most week, it's like, ah, oh, look at these results oh look at this thing that happened oh look at my team for the weekend like you know it's it's fucking rinse and repeat in the same shit which is fine you know there's worse things to bestow upon the world but i just think uh you know what, what the fuck are we doing who the fuck cares what i'm doing with my sober week what, what do people want to watch this shit for i fucking know the content is a bit of a struggle bus right now but i uh, i try to keep it entertaining where i can i have my get rich on sober series where i post skits about sewers there's something uh you know different and a bit unique compared to the usual routine. I hope I hope people enjoy them. But uh, I, I don't know, just something for me to think about. Uh, you, know, you know, a bit of a rant right now, but we do have the Euros coming up in just two weeks, so that's gonna be fun. I'll go through my teams next weekend. And then semi-related to this is that Ultimate Champions are introducing their own Fantasy Euro 2024 game, which also should be fun, hopefully. So uh, yeah, I'll make some content around that as well. And uh, hopefully more Ultimate Champions content in general going forward. That could be nice. And maybe even some Footium content now that Season 1's coming up. Uh, you know, the inaugural season is expected to launch on Footium around the end of the summer. So, uh, hey, that, that could be fun. Uh, repeating the word fun a lot, even though we're not having any. Uh, so a lot's going on without a lot going on would be how I would surmise this right now. But okay, back to actual server stuff. And uh, we, we've got this Essence come into the game, which, uh, you know, it sounds kind of cool. I think you get to craft cards or some shit with, with your with your fucking soccer points, wherever the fuck they are. Usually they're there at the top. I don't know. I assume it's going to be like the so coins replacement or maybe not the replacement. Maybe we'll just use it to, uh, you know, buy essence in the store, which we can then use to craft cards, apparently. I don't really know how it's going to work or what the chances of getting, uh, you know, a star card to a tier five, I assume... If you stack up more essence over the longer term period, you're going to craft a higher rated card. That would be my guess. Uh, the graphics are, are pretty cool. The graphics department never really get it wrong. And so where, I mean, you can have a hit or miss opinion on the card designs from year to year. But overall, you have to say the graphics team, uh, they, they smash it. So kudos to them. Uh, I think he's a West Ham player. But yeah, hey to them. We'll, we'll do the thing. Uh, okay, so, so what the fuck else? Does it say anything else? Oh, that's the end of it. Um... Yeah, you get them out of reward boxes or, or something. I don't know. Uh, yeah, here, for example, if you collect enough essence for the highest milestone, once crafted, you are guaranteed a star or tier one card. That That is pretty cool. That is pretty cool. I would almost liken it to MGC on Ultimate Champions, uh, to flip it back to the other, other game there in the sphere. So Ultimate Champions have their main token, Yuna, which obviously on server would be your Ethereum or your money to buy cards. But they also have a secondary token, MGC, which you can use to buy packs with players in. So I almost feel like this essence is essentially the MGC of Sower, which you can use to, instead of buy packs, craft cards. And it sounds like you can craft a, a star or a tier one. You don't actually decide to craft a Killing Mbappe or, oh, I want a Harry Kane. I'm going to craft a Harry Kane. It sounds like you craft a tier and you'll get a player from that tier. Pretty much the same as packs. Just a different way of doing it with, uh, you know, some cool graphics and, and all of that shit. So yeah, I, I feel like uh, a good introduction just is something else, uh, essentially something else free on top of what we've already got. So I don't really think anyone can be too upset with the implementation of this. So that would that would be my my posits on the essence. So I guess I guess something has happened this week. That's fun. Now let's look at how I did in the current live game week. I did fucking terrible. Uh, so that's pretty bad. That's pretty bad. That's pretty bad. Uh, DMPs everywhere. So none of that's going to go well. Uh, if we check the cat modes, I'm pretty sure Austin lost. Yeah, that's pretty fucking poo when your highest scoring players are 45. But hey, that's how it goes. And then here in Captain 40 Limited, I'm actually on for a tier two and only the two dollars. Could have gone for the infamous eight dollars, but I, I just didn't feel like it. And uh, I should have done because it would have paid off. Got the right captain. Shame Terraciano conceded with two minutes left of the uh, Conference League final there. He would have been on like a 90, which, uh, you know, maybe would have been a tier one pushing, pushing higher. Maybe I don't fucking know. Uh, but hey, we'll, we'll, we'll take anything we can get out of the cat mids while they're still here, uh, I guess, on the giveaway chart. Uh, that's going to be about a free. Actually, we can have a look at that right now. So for anyone unaware, I do monthly giveaways as part of this server series. Going to give that a free if I'm going to win something there in Cap 240. It's not a great game week, but it's not bad. Maybe, maybe a two. Uh, now we'll do a free because it puts me on to 22. That's an even number. I, I like even numbers. 
so yeah, I guess I'm giving away 22 quid for May. Gonna save that for a Euros Rivals game though, so stick around and subscribe to see that. And then let's see what's going on on the weekend. I feel like uh, the friendlies haven't loaded properly or something, so I said, so uh, I have a feeling Jan Oblak should be able to play here, but he's not here, so I don't even really fucking know if I can do this shit properly. Uh, he's got two games, Costa Rica, Uruguay, Austin a day later. Okay. Um, yeah, I, I, don't, I don't really know. Uh, this ain't going to fit the cap, is it? This isn't going to fit the cap. Um, oh, fuck me. Oh, Morph will be playing. Unless he's at the Olympics or some shit. I li literally have no idea. I need to research this. I don't know why I'm making a team for you guys, because I'm, I'm just going to change this anyway. And look, I'm one point off of getting Sebastian Drusy, and well, fuck me in the dick. That's fucking shit. Jadder O'Brien, fuck me, what an awful team. But what a great time we had, and I will catch you on the next great time we have, because I fucking love you.